Now at 4.30, controversy over a political ad that appears to put the face of a Southern California assembly member in the crosshairs of a gun. The ad was released by the California's Correctional Peace Officers Association. Well, now that assembly member is responding. NBC4's Conan Nolan live with what he has to say about this controversy. Conan. That's right. He's concerned. And keep in mind, it's been happened before. Congresswoman Gabby Giffords, for example, Arizona Congresswoman who was shot when she was in the middle of a constituent meeting. Plus, there was a shooting of Republican members of Congress when they were practicing for a baseball game in Washington. So those members of the legislature and of Congress are very concerned about violence, not just against themselves, but what is happening in the rest of society, which is why this video has become newsworthy. Law enforcement is not the enemy. We are not the combatant that they are attempting to make us out to be. The video is produced by the California Correctional Peace Officers Association, the union that represents the 31,000 correctional officers at California's 34 prisons. The narrator in the video, which appeared on the union's Facebook page, talks of the need to get tough on crime and to protect law enforcement officers. And then, without speaking of them by name, the video shows a wall with photographs of the members of the California State Legislature, with an image of a gun sight's cross hairs placed over the face of Los Angeles Assemblyman Reggie Jones Sawyer, the chair of the Assembly Public Safety Committee. A separate screenshot includes a quote from Union President Glenn Staley. This is a reflection of the current Executive Council's mindset, and I believe it is a direction that is long overdue. Today, the Assemblyman said he has asked for an investigation from the California Attorney General's office. Just recently, uh, there were violence against sheriffs. There's been violence against African Americans and Latinos, and especially an African American male, putting a target, a target on my back is something that we should never tolerate. Efforts were made for a comment from the prison guards union, but there has been no response. The video has been taken down from their Facebook page. And we understand other Democratic members of the legislature also along that wall had a target placed over their image. The assembly member says he's also asked for Capitol Police for direction on security measures as a result of that video. I'm Conan Nolan, NBC4 News.